This is 60 Seconds to Productivity with ThoughtOffice. I'm Dave Lockman with tips for using ThoughtOffice innovation software. Okay, this time we're going to address a question from a ThoughtOffice user who wasn't able to print as a fax or as a PDF after installing ThoughtOffice. So the first thing you do is install your fax modem as a printer under Windows XP. To do this, you do need to have a fax modem card installed in your PC. Click Start, then Control Panel, and Locate Printers and Faxes. Double-click Printers and Faxes, and that opens the Printer and Fax window. Click on Setup Faxing. Windows will install your fax modem software for you. After the fax software installs, you'll see a link that says Install a Local Fax Printer. Click that link, follow the prompts, and your fax software should finish installing. You can see that fax is now an option under Printers. Pretty cool. Open ThoughtOffice, click Print, and you'll see that you can select your fax modem as an output device, just like your printer. Now the next step is to install some PDF creation software. I chose one called Do PDF because it's free and it's easy to install. There are links on our website to Do PDF and other PDF creator programs that you can try. Please be aware that these are all third-party software and we really can't guarantee what will work best for you. So start the installation, follow the prompts, and install the software according to the manufacturer's instructions. Now open ThoughtOffice. Click Print, and you'll see that you can now also select Print to PDF as an output option. So there we have it. Both of those options are now installed. You can check our ThoughtOffice blog for links to the programs and more details. This has been 60 Seconds to Productivity with ThoughtOffice Innovation Software. I'm Dave Lockman. See you soon.